What is up, everybody? It's ADB95, and I got Axe by 94 here with me. Hello, everyone. We are about to jump into stage two, the group stage of Grunt League uh, Summer 2023. We got Fatizen and Bobby, two old acquaintances of uh, the Hogs of War competitive scene. Uh, we just got a small glimpse of the lineups. We're just gonna ju just jump into it. This game was uh, played a couple hours ago. We're redubbing it for the sake of you know having commentary. Yeah. Uh, uh, unfortunately, some some uh, weird uh, times for uh, playing. Like most of the people work in 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 this uh, in this at, at this moment. So. Yeah, like, e this week, this happened where nobody is playing when I'm available. So, I'm a little sad because of it, but at the same time, a little bit relieved. Anyway, we are starting on Graveyard Shift with Bobby going first. Bobby is playing Sky Blue. They normally uh, usually play Sky Blue, but Fab has switched to Yellow for the sake of this match. I mean, even the there's even a third player in uh, Group C. Is it Group C? Uh, yeah, Group, group C has got uh, three out of uh, four playing Sky Blue. <laughs> the last one being uh, Raven. Yeah. Qualified to the uh, at the very last game for uh, the second phase of the Summer League. Yep. Uh, Bobby starting off with a fairly strong uh, TNT, which just got a minimal amount of uh, water damage. On Fab's paratrooper, Fab is gonna think about it and try to look for a medic. If there is, a, I think I remember being one in Bobby's lineup. We didn't Bodies. really have time to soak them up, but uh, I like the the healing here. And hmm, let's see if he knows the position of the other medic. Could be on the right. Uh, uh, oh. oh, nice. Tricky position, though. Time is ticking. But he does manage to find it. And he also kind of body blocked the pig that just took his turn. So this was a pretty good move. Uh, but I don't know too much. I mean, it's too close to the only, you know, the main body of water. So I would have taken a few steps away, honestly. If he had managed to just completely line up with uh, that sapper... Uh, effectively body blocking. That would have been pretty good. And Bobby decides to not do the flamethrower thing, which could have probably killed this paratrooper off, but Kung Fu survives with 28 health, and it has a chance to ditch all of his jetpacks, basically. Because I don't think this guy will survive another turn. Yeah, I mean, in this situation, you're just gonna plonk all your jetpacks. A little bit of indecisiveness from Fab of who going who mm -hmm. to go for. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> yeah, but uh, decides to go for the medic and good positioning if he uh, decides to stay up there. Does Bobby have a ma have a scout? Ooh, okay. I think he he does. Yeah, that that's that's your. And so this is a problem now because twenty eight is not a really good. Yeah, he's just going okay. for the kill. Uh, going for the kill. It was a very good move to put your to put the paratrooper up there because he was on twenty eight. So like you said, it was not possible to make him skip without some head jumps. Mm. So basically, Fab said, "If you want to poison me, I'm gonna do another turn." Which would have given him the possibility to to kamikaze with, with uh, yeah, and kamikaze. So all around a really good play. Uh, I think this guy st that that guy still had uh, two jetpacks remaining, so it would have been a good idea. Yeah, we have longly talked about, uh, you know, making some kind of choice that uh, uh, puts your opponent in uh, a position Jeopardy, that, yeah. in, in which they have to make a decision. And time ticking again, but... Nice water skip. Yeah. A nice shot. Uh, yeah, I would say that definitely Fab is really improving on uh, time management. Yep. Seems seems like he prepared really well this, uh, this time in the game. Honestly, uh, we have seen him struggle a little bit on uh, the 30 second counter, and this looks like something he has worked on. So, well, no fun. Oh, yeah, by the way, let's talk about Bobby, because this is his first competitive match, not counting the recent uh, exhibition with Herp Derp, uh, since uh, late 2021. So, we're talking about 
the Ogs of War League Season 2. And yeah. just if you joined recently the, the channel, uh, on in September or November, Season 4 we're going to start. So it's more of a year plus. War, uh, one year and a half, basically, since uh, yeah. his last competitive match, was, which was the last day, a week, I guess, of uh, Hogs War League Season 2 against Raging Looney. Mm. Which is also why he uh, kind of needs to uh, come back to Grand League to earn a spot if eventually he makes it to the Hogs of War League. Yeah. I remember, I will remember the audience. Uh, meanwhile, Fab is uh, almost killing this medic, but I, I think he will survive just in time to skip his turn. Mm. And also, yep. uh, medic on last, so for, for Bobby. Yeah, it's an interesting choice, although this is pretty much a setup for a poison now. Mm. Which means that uh, Fab's medic is probably gonna uh, um, silence someone else with his drank. Yeah, uh, Bobby is just not caring about Fab's medic. Uh, by the way, I was gonna say before that uh, the two finalists Ooh. of uh, this uh, Grand League Summer will take a chance to fight in Hogs of War League. It's actually a bit more complicated than that, but let's just stay at that for now. You just need to get to the final to have a chance to play Hogs of War League. Yeah, because for now poison. it looks like three spots are available for the Hogs of War League, which would mean two coming from this uh, uh, summer. Yeah, and uh, one was taken by KB for the win in Grand League Winter. Yeah, um, KB is the only one that is guaranteed already a spot yeah. from newcomers. Uh, so Fab missed the double poison on the medic here, uh, there, but he's got plenty of time to get him out of the game. Meanwhile, his own orderly has survived, as we predicted, with that uh, half of a body block on Bobby's sapper. Yeah, probably will be, I don't know, maybe um, choosing the wrong targets on which to focus. Yeah, it seems to be a little bit of a problem for, for Bobby. Might be a little bit of rust, honestly. Ooh, Ooh, okay. This is not gonna make a skip turn. This is a waste. Oh no. Um, yeah. Probably he realizes now. Yeah, Should it's a visible. bit of a big waste. Oh, and he yeah, was it... next. It oh. was. It was the waste of a tranquilizer. Honestly, yeah. Missed skip turn on this. Yeah, Please. and the the guy who was body blocking was next, so tranquilizing it would have been perfect. Yeah. And if I made the math correctly, due to the fact that Fab has one less pig, his own scout would have had a turn right before the medic, so he would have been able to just poison him and make him die. But that's uh, a bit advanced, I, I, I gotta admit that. <laughs> nice mortar by Bobby in the meantime. Yeah. Probably paying off uh, with uh, the choice of making the medic go last for Bobby because now kind of got a uh, fab with a little bit of a tricky situation. Yep. So Dead let's mouth. see. <laughs> Still on a, on the lookout for this kill though. A sapper dead is pretty big at this point in the game. We're not quite into late game yet. Uh, I don't know. The bar seems to uh, to uh, to give Bobby a favor of health advantage. This guy should be your next priority if you're Ooh, Fab. Look at that double. Look at that double lineup there. Double. That double could be really troublesome for Fab. Yeah, it's maybe a little bit perfect. Overshot. It's a perfect though. Goes over the medic's shoulder, hits the the scout as well, and now Bobby mm. needs to. Like, make that medic skip somehow with five jumps. 30 is unfortunately a, tr a, a tricky number for poisoning. Definitely want to place this gunner somewhere between. Like, somewhere. I don't know, maybe near your medic? A tricky decision here for Fabi. Decides to go for the way harder shot of using the uh, shrapnel there. It doesn't pay off with only a 22. Mm, I guess he was afraid for, like, TNT. If, if he used the TNT, he was afraid to damage his medic and yeah. skip the turn, so... Would have still, <laughs> would have still damaged the, 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 the gunner with a TNT. That would have been m much safer. 
Mm. Oof. Oh, if I was Bobby, I would try the TNT here. There's a pretty good chance that you can just tickle the medic just yeah. enough to make him skip. Oof. Yeah, probably TNT would have been a better choice here. What does mm. Fab do here? Oh my god, how many picks are there in, are there in like the span of a two meters? Oh, two square meters. Everybody is like there. <laughs> the biggest problem for for Fab is he doesn't know whether Bobby is actually planning to do the the five hedge. Oh no, the self hit. I, it was already poisoned. The scout was already poisoned. So. Oh, was he? I think so. Oh yeah, that's the guy that took the double. Hmm. I mean, still fifteen less. HP. That's not uh, what he wanted. And I think Fab's medic is next, so he will get another turn. Yeah, that's quite a mistake. I've ever seen the two players. You know, we can definitely see some rust here in well both of two players. If uh, now Bobby has a yeah, I was gonna say I wouldn't exactly call a forty-four mortar a mistake, but still. No, no, no. I just <laughs> the mistake is not taking care of the medic right now. Yeah. Fab is gonna um, heal his own scout, which is a pretty good yeah. idea. And which also takes care of the poison. Yeah. Now and tranquilize anybody. Tranquilize. Would tranquilize... Uh, that sapper, hmm. that would be a good move. He goes for the gunner, which is also okay, I think. Nah, I don't like the gunner because it might slip, but okay. Uh, no, 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 that was perfect. That was perfect. Yeah, and Fab, was remember, Fab okay. wants to kill that orderly, so it's it's a good position. It doesn't matter that he's next to his own sapper. It it would have been okay with like near to a uh, to to anyone, but yeah, exactly. My my concern was that the position of the gunner maybe could have slipped. Away yeah, 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 the... and you you could see that he. Turned around and hit him from the right direction just for that purpose. Yeah, yeah. So the, that was a good the, turn. The, the positioning was really on point there. Ooh, but uh, Bobby resorting to the uh, grenade launcher, which, uh, I don't know, recently has never been a good sign. I'm... Where is Fab going with this? I have no clue. No. Do you no, want no. to do it now? Don't do it. So just don't do it. I mean, this I think will hit. Yeah, that's good. But the okay, problem but is, you have, two, you have two of your picks close together. Per oh make... no! With the sapper on the loose. Oh God. Would it? Would have the medic been next? No. No, I because don't think I, so. I, I mean, the but sapper would have. The sapper would had to move first. You know, the guy that's been stuck there ever since the medic came in this in this side. Oh, this might cost him. Yeah, I don't, I don't I understand don't the head jumps there. But uh, yeah, this is going to be a big hit. Yeah, definitely not the wisest choice. You just needed to wait for the sapper's turn. Yeah, that's a bit of a, bit of a concentration mistake, if you ask me. Yeah, well, well, we've seen some them. like small mistakes, like uh, the um, the tranquilizer and the dispositioning here. I think I think that Fab still has mar margin to you know came out victorious, not uh, nonetheless of these mistakes. But I don't know. You have you really need to gain this turn now, and taking care of the scout would be probably a priority over the engineer so yeah mm, i don't i'm not sure because the engineer has 150 health and he has in a good position for deeming dealing a lot of damage with water so yeah, i, I would have gone for the sapper to be honest no i think scout is a is, is the best call because you can't uh, skip turns now you know, if you give the opponent the chance to make make uh, to take out some turns extra to you Ooh. i think you don't yeah but really bobby is going to skip anyway yeah, but I don't know. I still I think that uh, taking a, a good chunk, maybe a hundred from the sapper, would have been a better move in terms of like you no, know, math wise. You don't want to stay there. No, no, no you don't want to stay there because it's. Uh, boy, 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 boy! It's the engineer's turn. Yeah, and uh, Abraham oh, yeah. will take two full turns before he can move again. Oh no, it's Bobby's. 
scout's turn. Okay. Oh, okay. This is a kind of a compromising turn here for Bobby, because he can only... Yeah, I guess he can only kill this guy. He could maybe... poison on... Uh... Could poison that sapper there? Yeah, sapper. poison. Uh, but yeah, but he also doesn't have time anymore. When he's leaving him here... That's a big mistake. Yeah. He should he should have to it. He should have waited those five seconds and decide on a target. Because he opted for, like in the back of his memory, the the paratrooper being there, but then he realized that he couldn't do nothing, so the other target was was too far away. Good choice there. Uh, I take my I take back my word, like uh, amazing choice to body block the engineer there. Was a good I don't think so because oh, well what what does he do now don't no no stop it fab <laughs> i was just praising you okay uh -huh. i mean it doesn't change that much the guy's on 45 yeah, okay. and bobby has no tnts left something we did not account for and two if bobby doesn't do anything crazy he will skip two turns in a row so i think this sapper is Still beefy, but uh, yeah, it's not going to be enough. The correct play the turn before was to uh, Bazooka. Both of your peaks. Uh, even just skipping a turn and doing nothing would have been fine, to be honest. Uh, the Bazooka would have been would have been okay because, okay, you the your your pick this is guy is still has a turn. TNT. Yeah, that's pretty much done. Unless Fab accidentally. Kills the gun, but still, that that would be still enough, because this guy's gonna take a lot of water damage now. Oh, <laughs> he no. jumped backwards. <laughs> the back jump in the water. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's a lot of damage, and also the gunner will push him back into the water. That is a great TNT by Fab there. Okay. Yeah, that it's game over. Because Fab has now two turns to deal 20 damage to that guy. Yeah, which means just a uh, standard poison. It would make it fancy with, that, with some water skips. Barely enough to skim over the water. And that is it. Fab takes game one and Bobby went first. Did he? Yeah, I think he did. Oh, well. Internet crashed, so I'm left alone for the rest of this two minutes. But yeah, I'm gonna uh, just I'm gonna just finish it up. Well, Fab is just contemplating doing nothing, to be honest, because the game is already over. He's just he just has to skip his turn, and then uh, I will Axby will come back to us at the start of uh, game two. So nice. Let's just cut to the chase. Uh, Fab wins game one on Graveyard Shift. We will see you guys in game two on Pigs in Space. And we are back. Uh, funny enough, we are staying in nighttime after Graveyard Shift. We're gonna play Pigs in Space. Is it nighttime though? Yeah, it is night time. Night time. I mean, I guess space it's night time. Moon uh, whatever. It's it's night. Uh, it, it's it's he it's a head cannon. Um, so Fab is going uh, to keep his grenadier for the last game. He's gonna go with just the medic. Meanwhile, Bobby is playing grenadier and leaving the medic for the last game. And uh, he's got a pretty offensive lineup. Uh, he does always put a gunner in the mix, which is nice i suppose although not very it, it does put you at a little bit of a disadvantage overall yeah i mean it, it depends on the map obviously but gunner are probably the most uh uh unused to be kind to, to say it kindly um class i, I, of, I think the, the, the best I, th I think the best way to describe it is they are the least reliable class Okay. I mean that that sign that that sound that kind of kind of not nice for towards the gunners, but okay. did it? 
Yeah, I mean, he's not reliable. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not. I'm not a Brit, so okay. you can. You can. So, uh, uh, I, I know. I, I, I know the language pretty well, but I can't mimic the the sarcasm. So. <laughs> Sure. Well, uh, as we can see, we are playing on the new patch. Let's say, let, let's call it like this of the yeah. of the map. And uh, piece of space is now not following anymore the one three five two four pattern. I actually am not sure if it does. It's just the spawns are very different on it on their own. And mm -hmm. uh, the, the most important thing for me is that it, although it doesn't have any crates, and it, I think it's the only map that doesn't have any crates. Uh, nowadays, it is not a beginner map anymore. Mm. Indeed, indeed. Like the the buildings are definitely adding something, some strategical value, especially when the spawns are involved. And yeah, yeah, it's the same thing as pigs in space, where uh, it's as graveyard shift. <laughs> sorry, where uh, basically now you cannot be guaranteed that you can use the like slow range tac uh short range tactics like moma and all that because there's buildings involved bit of a short uh bazooka there he did the uh, 22 damage but i think for the 40 it was able to stamp on the gunner's face i think it was worth it i definitely say so but was uh, did bobby start the uh, last game yes he did okay uh, Bobby started Fab 1, and now it's uh, Fab starting. And look at that Grenadier's position after yeah, the train. Also, also, it was tranquilized, so. Yeah, but the position kind of protects uh, Bobby's Grenadier from damage. And it stays up there! That's so annoying for Fab. <laughs> well, Lossy. He now has three pigs very close to each other in that in that area. Yeah, and the poor grenadier is kind of getting bang gang banged. You can see in the minimap. I would have used that term, but it got the point. Um, A lot of swim time. Yeah, Bobby is just uh, completely destroying that scout. Ooh, he's gonna. Close it down, and that uh, scout is dead. It's gonna hit a bit, a bit of self damage for him. Uh, I think uh, like twenty five in total, something like that. Yeah, I saw also, uh, also a six and a four in the explosion of the scout. Yeah, Fab is gonna just continue with the. Mm. Okay, so this would have been a yeah. would be a good idea if that sapper, other sapper wasn't right next to, where he was put, planning to put that TNT. This is kind of annoying for, uh, for Fab, honestly. Yeah, yeah, and you could see that this one, this one shrapnel that he just threw, he purposely aimed it to the left a little bit to just make sure that this time it go, it, it would have come down. But, um, correct me if I, if I'm wrong. Both of the para, both of uh, Bobby's paratrooper were used already. Yes, and uh, they so, were unfortunately for for Bobby very far away from the action there. Yeah, because this kind of ganging up, although Fab is really has been really critical to keep as much distance as possible, would have opened some possibility for you know some uh, gang uh, some bunching up and damage. Yeah, and uh, Fab so. is just gonna continue to control that grenadier. <laughs> What are okay. you laughing at? No, you don't know. You don't want to know. Okay. <laughs> Honestly, you don't want to know. <laughs> okay, I, I was very fearful, but uh, I I'm gonna, I'm gonna go home with that information. Yeah. <laughs> that's just that's exactly what you need. Uh... Perfect. Perfect. Bobby, uh... I think Scout needs to go into the action now. Needs to claim at least a double, if he if he wants to stay in the game. Best mm. best possible thing is to make a double and having the medic involved, but positioning from Fab is really good. There, you, uh, you have to th oh. you have to think that in, this, in these situations, a double is just not worth it. Yeah, although a beautiful double was that was just uh, 
uh, pulled out of the, the of the hat by Bobby. Uh, you have to think that in these situations, like the double is just not worth it because the medic is out, which means that one of them is going to be killed. So just the difficulty of a double is just not worth it. You either go for the medic or don't do poison, in my opinion. Or a double. <laughs> Well, in case it, it's fairly easy to do so, yes, but uh, Fab is just keep uh, is just uh, a little rusty on the minimal distance to use the bazooka from. Mm. Uh, this this time he had the chance to you know adjust it, uh, adjust a fair distance to not get some uh, some own advantage. Ooh, we you don't want to do it. that, Poppy. We have seen it. I think he has to. I mean, uh... yeah, I mean he's a paratrooper. He could have just. Jetpack to the other side. Okay, jetpacking to the other side might have been a play to at least consider because it is true you don't get those those twenty damage, but you definitely have time to do something. And this something, it's bunching up a bunch of a bunch of yellow pigs, and that would have been a good play. I don't know. Again, I probably would have taken, you know. Those five extra seconds that the game gives you to consider that, at least. Yeah. Uh, Fab considered here going for the, the shrapnel on the scout, but the medic was very close, so he's just going to say, screw it, I'm going to do the easiest thing, which is TNT this guy. Mm. And I think it's a wise choice uh, right now. Yeah, Honestly, it's the way better move to do in, in that turn. Yeah, obviously that doesn't, pl doesn't apply to me, because, I'm, uh, because I usually finish my... <laughs> My shrapnels before the TNTs, but uh, that's a whole other story. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm just saying, in that situation, you would have probably hit the paratrooper with a shrapnel, but you would have still hit the paratrooper. Yeah, and it would have mostly probably been a, been a 15, a 50 anyway, so. So, uh, the Grenadier has finally skipped his turn, which means that uh, Fab doesn't have to hold the trigger for him anymore. He can kill him, but he's going to do it next turn. Meanwhile, the water just uh, goes batshit crazy. Flashy plays from Fab. Yeah, this is a big mistake for me. Like, why Why did you just... I mean, okay, he might have considered Ooh. changing his idea midway, and that did still you... makes it good. <laughs> did yeah, you just... know that, uh, that not doing that water would have been uh, basically stamping your pig on the blimp? Are you sure? Because he did took a lot. He did take a long time uh, swimming. Yeah, but I think maybe at that point he's uh, the, the the blimp is just done maneuvering. I don't know. Also, great uh, bazooka from uh, Bobby here, doing a lot of damage on these two sappers. And also, he you see that he, this is a thing that mostly just speedrunners do. That you can like hold the 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 aiming button and switch the camera around to see what's happening. Yeah, I have no clue uh, on how to do that, uh, the trick. I tried a couple it's, of times, but then it's, it's easy. It's pretty simple, I actually. I, I know, but I can't do it. Don't do the same mistake. Okay, thank you. <laughs> uh, was the Grenadier going to be next? Uh, not sure, but it's definitely the moment to kill him. Because mm, if he wasn't, then he could have tranquilized someone else. But it, it's it's uh, if you're not sure, it's much better to do this. Yeah, I think I, I got lost uh, uh, here in commentary booth, so I, I don't blame if uh, the play the player did lose this information, but it might make the difference. Although Ashubert Bobby is down, so it's now three v three, isn't it? It is, it is, and uh, Bobby is scoring the kills now. Um, Fabs looks to have a little bit more health. Mm, just a side note. I, a side note, I would, with uh, Fab's Medica, would have healed this engineer here instead of the paratrooper near to the water. And the reason it's it's nearness, it's nearness to the war to the water, since uh, oh yeah, yeah, that would, makes would uh, would have been would ki would get killed anyway. I don't know. It, it's still something yeah, but it's still it it's still. Uh takes out the possibility of him skipping. So I guess it would have been 
easier for Bobby to make him skip on 48 and poisoned. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 of course. Uh, like, that's a, that's an easy, just a, a snipe. So, yeah, I think he, I think he, Fab was right in, in healing him instead. Although that, that is going to be a problem. That guy is going to survive with eight, 11 health and he's a sapper. He cannot move to the other side. Oof. That is a huge problem for Fab. How many, how many complication could... That's not going to be enough. No. Oh no, that was, it was brave, but it was definitely not the right play. <laughs> yeah, uh, I just needed a little bit of... Uh, of fear, which is weird, because usually Fab is the one to, to do the safest choice most of the time. Uh, I guess it's, it's good that he's showing a little bit more confidence, but yeah, the, in that case, you would have just had to throw a shrapnel to the other side. I mean, the, yeah. the scout was presenting himself to you. He was very visible. I noticed that the decision was definitely instant here. I probably would have taken a few seconds more to consider. Ooh, autobound heal? No, no, no. He's, he's way too close to the entrance, I would say. Uh, okay, now, now you, you need to... to... Yeah, that's abs ab uh, an absolutely needed heal here. Yeah, and, uh, and it's a 3v2 have... where two are a sapper with 41 and a medic that only has one tranquilizer left. I think Bobby is in front now. I don't know. You have to. Sp you, he still has to spend his uh, last tranquil. So, and I uh, like the idea of. I mean, using it's it not on... gonna do much. I think. Uh, it's prevent preventing poison, so I, it is fine. It is a oh, good so that guy is pretty low health, I think. Yeah, but not oh too much. Oh my, look at the health of the other two. Yeah, it's gonna he be a problem for, for Fab to take those down. Blocked. I think he should have body blocked. I don't know, that... That mm. skip turn... That skip turn with the, with the suicide of the engineer is... Having pretty so big, much, yeah. Yeah, but so much impact. If he lands this shot decently... I think he's on his way to win. That's a oh, it's a 70 <laughs> Mortar! Oh my god. Welcome back, Bobby. Well, <laughs> he hasn't lost his touch. Definitely not. Uh, okay, the Medic is on full health and he can use uh, body blocks very, very um, smartly because, let's just say, paratroopers and gunners aren't the most... The, the, the better equipped, the best equipped guys to, you know, break body blocks without some self damage. Oh, uh, unlucky there. Unlucky there, and uh, okay, 19. Keep that in mind. Yeah. It is uh, now. This is the place to stay. You have to damage someone else. You sure? You think the, the paratrooper is next? Oh! Oh, uh, come on. Take some time. Okay, yeah, but... definitely next because the the the, the seventy happened pretty recently, pretty, pretty recently with the mortar. Okay, yeah, Bob needs to count his turns to. Uh, to, like, to, he needs to prepare his next move very well. Bobby is very smartly going. Away. Far away, is yeah. Good. He's definitely not new to this kind of situation. He definitely uh, managed to grab a game with the, with the only a medic in the in the past, if I remember correctly. Yeah. So he definitely uh, also, knows this kind of situation, how to play around them. This is the perfect outcome for for Bobby. He managed he he damaged that that guy, but without killing him. That makes more work for Fab to do, and uh, uh, you know enhances. It's one more turn to, to for a thing don't, to do for Fab. Get too stubborn. It's time to kill the scout, but you don't. You can't miss the body block now. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, that's gonna be self damage. Yeah, because he forgot that that is, that's a kill. He definitely wanted to do, to do some damage. And keeping the body block, the medic is getting near the body of water, which is not a good idea. Okay, not that close, but... Okay, I thought it was way worse, but... Oof. Yeah. Yeah, it's still a big hit. So... Yeah, every, every pixel could count, especially if Bobby pulls out another, another 70. Seems a little bit too long, so... 44. Yeah, but that's still that's way more than enough, I think. To mm. Yeah, the Patch has too much maybe, health. 
Is Fab deciding to not show the health? No, no, no. That's not that's not uh, even a thing. Like he can just check in his own turn. Sure. You're right. Hmm. And the patch trooper is next anyway, so. How much does the, does the medic have left? I don't know, actually. Finally okay. managed to hit one, but that's that this guy's gonna need another two turns to to die, and that's the problem for Fab. He doesn't have another two turns. Well, well. I don't know. He might. Yeah, that's basically two two sweeps for for Bobby. Doesn't even need to risk a bazooka. I don't know. Uh, there's definitely some room to to play with the uh, with the. Ah uh, no, I don't think so. Yeah, I mean the the gunner of Bobby has two health, so it's gonna be definitely difficult to move. Yeah, I'll yeah, but I'm just saying the your now. win condition right now is that Bobby somehow misses his next shot because you need to dual damage this guy. You have to try to do something about it. Maybe, you know, grenade launcher and go on the other side, uh, near the angle, maybe near a body of water. Uh, you, have, you don't have the idea ready? No. Nope. Which is bad. Okay, that was pretty good, okay. honestly. But still, I think it's fruitless, because all Bobby needs to do is to, uh, like, throw a bazooka there... And uh, his own paratrooper has has more health than the medic, so it's not going to be hard to kill. Kill him. Just needs to do it in a way that doesn't also hit him, kill himself. I mean, the medic is below twenty. Yeah. Oh, he was okay. He was. I, th I thought he had more health, but Bobby takes game two. I think Fab uh, just missed that crucial turn where he just. Uh, uh, where he killed a scout, he needed to like plan around a little bit more with the uh, the next guy of Bobby's team. I think, unfortunately, that was decisive. That that mani managed to, you know, that was crucial. That's the point. Yeah, I give credit to Bobby. I mean, uh, he did put with it uh, grenade launcher uh, uh, the Fab engineer in a bad spot uh, and uh, Fab's reaction wasn't good enough so props yep. to him so now we're gonna decide who wins on a pretty special map it's gonna be the first time we'd see the new and improved uh, that's that's basically a meme right now that that sentence barnyard blitz we'll see you there all right <laughs>
because of this. Somehow, yeah. It's okay, wasn't some damage, and I guess that's okay. If you can do some other damage to the pillbox, you erase the enemy pillbox, uh, pillbox and do some damage to the medic, mm -hmm. I guess. I was gonna say, like, when you have a grenadier in first and the me enemy medic is in fifth, I would even consider hitting somebody else and, like, making everybody else hit the medic. Because, you know, if you can deal a big chunk of damage to somebody else, it's still good. Yeah, but not in this, not in this map. Woo! I was afraid of the mines there. Uh huh. But definitely not in this map, since you are not guaranteed to hit with everyone. Ooh, okay. Ooh, my god, Fab is just... Uh, Machatino mode, he's just... Uh, he's got tunnel vision. Yeah, and uh, the yellow the, the yellow guy is kind of... It's kind of yeah, it, right? do, it doesn't help. Yeah, I got... <laughs> oh, we took both air bursts. No. Oh, yes. No, no, no. Can he manage to? I think it's still hit. Oh no! What? No. He, <laughs> he aimed up. Uh, that that would that would have been a perfect turn if he managed to hit that forty. That would have been a fantastic turn in my but opinion. Why taking the peel box? It makes no sense now. Uh, you 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 basically shoved a uh, a cluster on it. Yeah, but uh, oh wow, that that cluster did exactly a hundred damage. Would have destroyed a normal pillbox. I don't know. I feel like it gave Bobby something to remember for later. Meanwhile, for example, Fab has yes, it is a paratrooper in his in his pillbox, but that paratrooper doesn't have anything, so he can just leave him there. Mm. Plus, plus the guy inside has 140 health, so it's almost. Kind of unlikely that Bobby will manage to to kill him before... Oh, yeah, you, you're you right, though. He could just destroy the pillbox and then tranquilize with the medic. That is right. That's correct. I didn't think about that. Yeah. But... If the pillbox was full health, I would have... Oh, no! No, 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 no. Oh. I saw him... Moment when everything goes bad, and you need really need to take a breath and yeah. yeah. Uh, actually, I saw what I, I I saw what he was thinking there. He kinda he tried to you know measure the poison the same thing as he did the cluster, but it ended up being a little too far. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this is not the correct move. I would be totally fine with taking a 40 out of this guy. For a couple turns. Just don't need to... I mean... To be fair, the, fr the flamethrower is not a wasted weapon. Because it, it can only do so much damage to buildings. So it's not really mm. wasted. Is Bobby considering a TNT into a mine? I think he is. And I think it would be enough. Although this guy is still 130. Okay, never mind. He took damage before taking the, the crate. What's the point? You you need to trank. You got the guy out of the pillbox just to trank him. What if you killed him now? What if you kill him now? Yep, that's all the air bursts gone. Oh, wow. This game. This game this is game uh is played uh, so much different than I thought. Yeah. Uh it's getting pretty complicated. Oh, really? Okay, it, it makes sense to have the double gunner, uh, honestly, in this map. I, <laughs> I think I will steal that in, in, in the future. <laughs> Actually, if he can place it just right, it could do 30 to the guy that comes out. Ooh, oh, that was close. <laughs> it was close. And also, it did not do any damage to the, to the guy. It did not do the 20. And that's, that's right. Did I see that correctly? I think you're right. Yeah, because the guy is still on 130 inside, and Bobby did not take a health rate. Yeah. Oh. That was very unlucky for Fab. And, okay, are you really doing this? Oh my god. I mean, this is... Ooh, Ooh it could be a miss, and it is a miss! 
Oh god, and that that medic now is so dangerously close to the minefield. To the minefield, yeah. yeah. The grenadier is also so happy to see that. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, basically, since that medic already took some damage, a, a high explosive grenade plus the minefield would be enough. I don't think he's gonna consider just that, but... Feel like you have to do it. Uh, I don't know. Or maybe you, you leave the medic since, like... Banking on some future mistakes. No, oh, that's I a think. Really good yeah, just yeah. a little bit just of a. Okay, okay. That, that's fine. Okay. That's fine. Not bad. Probably the the, the sixty damage rule would have been better, but. Oh, the guy, the grenadier is dead. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I guess he wasn't considering this guy just right behind him. Yeah, but I, I guess it's a fair trade, you know. You um. I guess so, but he could have still placed himself better, so that the paratrooper would have and been a hard, would have had a yeah, hard time doing this. You have to consider that. You have to consider this. It was not also Bobby. I'm not sure if Bobby has enough time to shoot, and he doesn't because the grenadier heroically triggers some mines. Okay, saving himself in the process. Uh, the medic is at uh, 30. Hmm. I thought he was at 20. That yeah. seems is quite a quite a. Mm. You might want to go for the double, although on one ha on one uh... ah, easy. You you trigger the barrel the barrel here. Yeah, it's easy for Bobby to to trigger this to to yeah. counter this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. What? Oh, <laughs> what just happened? That was the in most insane. Okay, uh, that that needed a pause. All right, we're back. Uh, apparently, not only pause, but Bobby paused after that double, that crazy double poison with the help of a mine. But uh, also, my internet couldn't hold it, so yeah, couldn't handle it. I, I was about, I was gonna say. So yeah, let's continue. So, okay. So what just happened? A, a double that was intended for two pigs hit the first one, then came back, hit a mine, and went for a completely different pig. That was insane. Grenadier is dead, regardless of a mine. Yeah, and I like Bobby's approach. Okay, yeah. I, I got I got a lucky, but I still got hit. No question asked. And yeah. yeah, let's see those new resources coming up. It's a jetpack, okay. Ooh, a jetpack could be more? very handy here. Yeah, you have to try to push him out. Or just maybe wait for it. Like, think about it. Uh, why body block? No. Oh, God, God. Thinking too much. Yeah. But, uh, I think you needed to angle it a little bit more down, or maybe I'm just an idiot, and that is his perfect. Well, but, well 41 is not perfect, but it's not bad either. And he didn't he didn't hit himself at all, so... In, in the panic, he managed to do a very good shot. You gotta trigger that barrel at some point. You can't really. Uh... I not sure if I, I. I'm not sure I want to kill to trigger that barrel because there's also a chance that I might force Bobby to skip a turn with the medic. Yeah. Okay. But you have to. You have to do those five damage. Otherwise. Uh, uh... Ooh, that might be too long. Yes, it is. Yeah, it seems long, but... Bobby is not the favor of the poison this time. Yeah, not even. Not, not even that day. And also, else. I yeah, yeah. Just collect those. Just it's it's okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, it's I, safe. I, I, it's safe. I mean, <laughs> it doesn't look safe, but it is. It's like, it's like a like a vendor in the street. Like you open their trench their trench coat, and they're like, yeah, it, it's safe. Trust me. <laughs> trust me. And this uh, dong is like flopping around also. <laughs> why did that? Why did? Okay, it's my fault. Yes, definitely. Your it, fault. it is my fault. I, I apologize. And um, this time the short range mortar isn't that good for Fab. He just managed to do managed to do a twenty. Ooh, he's invading with a sapper, and that is kind of a problem for Fab. Yeah. Also, That's very also good fifteen. 15. Yeah, and. I think the time is ticking on the on the medic, you know? You have to do those 5 damage now. 
Otherwise, uh, Bobby's medic is gonna have another turn. I don't know about that. I think Fab needs to focus on these guys that are on his side. As much as I agree with your with your point, I think if the, the if as many if the sapper takes more turns, it's gonna be de uh, devastating for Fab. Just move this guy away. He's the only one that is in is in range for a, a trank anyway. Okay, yeah, and just... hear me out. Hear me out. Now you rocket launch the paratrooper. Hope he triggers a mine, which kills also, which makes the five damage to the medic. Oh my god, that almost oh. happened. <laughs> oh and... no. I mean, that's not that bad. For, for I don't Fab. know. If, if you get tranked now... I... How? Like I said, Fab moved every single one of his pigs away from trank site. But you definitely are in trank side, especially for just basically staying on the stairs. Ah, oh, okay. That guy. It's not is easy. It. Ah, no, that's Things a hit. Not... That's a hit. Uh, well, definitely Bobby is the one who knows though, those kind of ranges. Okay, so uh, Bobby will skip with his medic, but Fab will also skip with his uh, scout. And the problem for Fab is that that sapper is safe. Completely. Oh, but he wants to trigger that barrel? Does he want to trigger the barrel? Trigger the barrel? No, that's not that was not enough. Was it? Just move away from here. You don't want to be close to the medic. And he is close to the medic. <laughs> okay, that guy is super dead. <laughs> Ultra death. <laughs> Uh, Skip to the animation. Okay, so Bobby's making a mistake here, though. He needs to kill his own medic and hitting and hit Fab's uh, gunner on the left side. Ah, uh, yeah, that's true. He still has another turn to do it, though. And also positioning. Fab can easily. Oh wait, Fab. Uh, Bobby still has a, a scout on that side. I think yeah. Fobby, Bobby is in front. Bobby. <laughs> yeah, Bobby is Bobby definitely in front. <laughs> I know, I know. Bobby, it, it was a great name, honestly. I know. <laughs> Bobby is in front, but definitely. like we said, that positioning on that guy is pretty dangerous. If Fab can manage to hit the perfect mortar, he can fall on the minefield. That looks way too short. Yeah. Does manage to get another twenty. And a five. Okay. How much does this guy? Oh yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's cool it's basically uh -oh. close to being over for me. And uh, this could also be like poison on your medic and on Fab's pig. Where I don't. Shot? I don't think that's a possibility. I think it's definitely possible. I mean, we have seen way crazier stuff happening now, so. I guess so. Yeah, but uh, Bobby Probably is not caring not about his own medic. Nah. Okay, that that's uh, that's gonna hit. Then this Just turn, turn by ch charging up, uh, it's gonna be forty out of fifty-one. It's gonna be thirty-two out of fifty-one, so nineteen. Oof. And that's also poison range, but Fab misses, yeah. and now it's the it's the Sapper's turn, and that's uh. Yeah, I think uh, Bobby is uh. Close to is winning. There's just too much health for Fab to deal with. Mm. Unless he pulls up like a crazy mine shot or something. Like, why going for the grenade launcher there? Uh, okay. Just to show, show off some skills. Why not? Okay, so Fobby's gonna skip now. So Fab absolutely needs to use that close positioning there. Mm. Especially on he the gunner. I would <sighs> even say. I would even say you try with the bazooka, like to have more chance. Or with the with the grenade. The, the roller, the roller grenade. grenade. I feel like the roller grenade doesn't just have the reach, but it's too short. This is once again a little short. Mm, those mortar are really costing him. But on the other hand, he can finally move with his scout. It's an extra turn. This 120 is still decent. Like, I'm trying to think if there's something Fab could do. Maybe just get a double poison Ooh. on the other side. Yeah, you absolutely need those this double poison if you want to 
have, have a chance to win. Chance. Yeah. Yeah. What? 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 Oh no! I forgot to beat <laughs> the sky blues. <laughs> what? Stop, stop! Stop the game and get a rewind. Yeah, please get a rewind. This is just too important. Yeah. I thought I. I think he might have forgot the to, to be the that he was the yellow in for a second. Yeah, yeah. but uh, yeah, I guess he didn't feel like doing a uh, uh, a rewind for you know fairness sake. Just too important. <laughs> I appreciate the pronunciation there, but yeah, I agree. When something <laughs> like that happens, you just just ask for a rewind. It's 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 not shameful at all. And this might have costed the game for Fab there. Yeah, that's a big of a big problem for him now. He needs a miracle shot to get out of this. That seems to be still too short. But still, at least gonna hit the first guy, yeah, 45. They probably need to, you know, uh, force player to play with some with a secondary color a little bit more often. I know it's been on the on the. Uh, it's been an argument for a little bit. Uh, I personally think they should just agree with each other. Like, what is the problem with just talking about it? And I guess Fab, on his own, decided to go for for a yellow, so I don't think it's a problem. You might want to hide, honestly. That that could have been a great plan, you know. Uh, with the double poison, then hiding, honestly. Oh, boy, boy, boy. I mean, it's still damage, and it's okay, in my opinion, to do this. Although, yeah, yeah that's a TNT. You're, def you're definitely in the... On the back foot, so you really want to try something to. Always you know. going for a shrapnel. That's not really needed, if you ask me. He only manages to get a thirty. Mm, maybe he felt like it was a comfortable, uh, comfortable position. I suppose. And this could be. Is... This could, could be a kill. Be a... Could still be a mine kill, yeah. There's no reason to body block the scout. Ah, oh wait, no, there is a reason to body block the scout. If he fails the shot, the gunner is next. But he doesn't and fail the course. shot. He hits. <laughs> Anticlimatically. Yeah. And now it's a 2v1, but uh, Bobby Ooh. has way more health. And the poison on his side also. Yeah. I mean, if Fab if Fab hides next turn, there may be still a chance. Uh, what was the opponent on? Sixty-five. Sixty-five. So yeah, he would need to. You should consider a hide now. Yeah. Yeah. He's dead. He goes for a twenty-five. Maybe his idea is to take damage, then five head jumps, and then damage of the other scout. No, he can't. Do that. I don't think he'll be an. Oh wait, he'll be on forty. Yeah, but that still won't be enough. The scout, the enemy scout, is on hundred and and. Wait. I mean, I mean, you bank on some. Oh, okay. Okay, that that closes yes. the game. It's over. Uh, foo foo foo. It depends yeah, how far. Good move. Are. Good move from Bobby. It, it's uh, it's done. Twenty six. Yeah. There's no way. Mm. Unfortunately, I would say, I would feel like saying there's still a chance, but knowing uh, the aiming skill of Bobby, I uh, feel like those chances are really, really slim. Yeah, I would need to. He would require two misses from Bobby. Yeah, and I think even at with least two no misses from Bobby, either. and also not positioning yourself here. Hmm. That's it. Okay, that Bobby wins. Him. It was a weird Barnyard Blitz. Uh, I think Bobby uh, deserved to win in the end. Uh, I do want to stress it out for the umpteenth time. I feel like we, we said that a lot of times. If a fluke that's rewindable, I guess. I don't know if that's even a concept. But yeah, you I guess, like, please do ask for a rewind because... Mm. 
it, it, it does feel a little... Uh, it does feel a little weird when uh, a mistake like that decides the game. Yeah, and worst case scenario, you get a no, but then uh, it's your yeah. point that it's like a yeah. dickhead. Yeah, don't, don't don't be afraid to to ask for that. Yeah, at least ask. But yeah. I don't know. I think uh, that regardless, uh, probably would have won anyway, even if he if uh, it would have been at least closer. That's for sure. It would have been it would have been closer. Still a good, uh, still a good and close games. I would say, GG Pop to Bobby. Welcome back to the competitive scene. And uh, yeah, and what, what a way to start again for him. Yep. GG to both, and we'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.